Tuna Libra and Cross Watchers alike. This is the reading for mid September to October of this current year, specifically 2019. Anyway, <clears throat> hope y'all are doing well today. Libra, this is for Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Check your charts. If this resonates with you, good deal. If not, do not worry about it. It's just a card game. Doesn't come true if you don't believe in it after all. Just boop your nose and away you go. Right? Right. Everyone who's usually here, thank you very much for subbing, viewing, subscribing to my channel and getting readings. It's greatly appreciated. Any newcomers? I, for anyone looking for a personal reading, all the information is in the description box below. First reading is on the house, and I do take tips and donations. Thank you very kindly in advance. Anyway, back to business. Libra, hope you all are doing just swimmingly as of late. I don't know. Things just seem like, they, like okay, like, so the shadows of judgment kind of help me out because it's like I get to follow what's kind of going on with you. And you guys just seem like such a weird adventure. Like, I don't know where you're going. It seems like you're on, like, I don't know. It's like that movie The Fugitive. Like, you're innocent, but people are still hunting you down like a dog or some shit. I don't know. This, or some of y'all. Not all of you, though. What have we got? Eight of a Cups. You're mourning something from the past. Well, you got a bright future ahead of you, and you're probably torturing yourself over it more than what's necessary. Okay. Uh, let's see. Like, literally, it's right above you, and you're, like, fueling the, your own monster. I don't know. That's, like, really weird that that's the root of the issue. Here's you being the medium, or the stem, and it's like you're causing yourself to be in that torture situation, you know? Uh, thoughts and feelings is a king of pentacle, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Reverse right here. It might feel like he's owed something. Might also be like a pathetic loser who's a moocher. Um, instead of being the provider they're meant to be. But that's beside the point. You know, could be either or with him. And <clears throat> the root of this is Death's card. Or Scorpio's card, I mean. Death. Um, things ending. Things dying. Somebody changing or whatever, right? Okay. Let's see what's coming up. Princess of Cups, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. Someone like standing on their tiptoes, ready to open up about love and their emotions. Even after being hurt, you know? Ooh, Ace of Cups. Okay, interesting, Libra. And the Hermit Reverse. Ew. Ooh, that is cute. I like this coming up right here for you. That's kind of romantic. Like, all that love helps you, like, get out of this isolation and come to see your true self. That's so cute. All right, what's the vibration? Well, hold up. Four cards came up. Um, I don't know. Just three. You are probably still in your head. While trying to fix yourself about something or somebody who I feel like you want communication with. It just, like, you want to heal yourself, but, like, your mind's stuck on the communication more than anything. Like, the communication isn't blocking it or whatever. It's not like it's an obstacle for you in order to get out of that. Uh, it's more like it's the stem of it. It's just kind of like, oh, it's the words. The words. Okay. The vibration here, the Empress Reverse, might be a little bit bitter. Might not be happy about this situation for how it might be. I don't know. She's like not very like could be it could be you, honestly, like Libra, because like she does carry the Venetian energy, also Taurus and female Aries, of course. So you could check your chart for all those signs as well. But I feel like she's not in the, um... I think she's just straight up mad. She's just, like, pissed all the time. She's like, rah, 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 and such, you know? That's a little bit. You're probably, like, a little... I 
want to say you're aggravated, irritated, you're just not in the mood to be happy. Like, kind of like that. Two seconds. I need to go grab a sweater. It is cold. Even though I know it's going to be hot later. Excuse me, kids. Thank you. I'm so happy. I finally got my kitties, like flea treatments and now they're just able to lounge like they used to do and all the fleas are dying and it's like ah beautiful there's peace in my home again you know okay Libra all right looking from this it's like there is a lot of you know there's a lot of self torture on this side there's just a lot of it there's a lot of it but it's like to the point where it's like uncontrollable like I said it's like the root of the problem but it's like it stimulates your brain a little bit I feel like because it's like literally charging inner like well, not even energy just straight up lightning right into this lady's head there's a witch in the background but the witch isn't it doesn't like the witch is eating lunch like she's not even doing her job anymore she just comes in and be like this is the easiest job I've ever gotten like the benefits are great um, I get like three months worth of vacation time every year like I and and the bitch does it on her own like it's almost like that like there's a witch but she's not doing anything she's just chilling at her table eating her fucking sandwich um this person right here is the one doing all of the work for her like she like this bitch doesn't even need to be at work she might as well just call off because she's she might as well be fired honestly because she's not really doing anything she isn't like helping you know or whatnot and then up above that, it's like this person is um, stuck so much in their past. They don't see that the future, that dynamic, fiery start is there for them. It's like they don't want to make a full circle. And it's almost a circle, but they don't want to go to that full circle. It's like, no, I, I still looking at this like, ah... There's so much so treasures back here. There's still something frozen back here. There's something at my feet. I know there was. This was, like, super precious to me. And, like, mind you, eventually that flame's gonna blow up that bomb right there. And they're not gonna have a choice in it. Because, you know. Emotions and shit. Let's see. Um. There might be an earth sign. Or you just feel like if something's owed to you. Also, cross watchers. Um, switch where you need to. Take what's yours and leave the rest with the pound of salt, right? Right. But there is like an earth sign. Either they feel like there's something owed to them, or you feel that way, or maybe there is someone who's supposed to act like a provider who turned out to be more than a disappointment than anything. And, and that's a thought and feeling right there, but then below that is this feeling of death, right? Scorpio's card. So I don't know where this is all leading up to, but it's really, really crazy tasty. All right, Eight of Cups. Nine of Swords, that could be you. You have intention and hunger. You are like chirp, chirp, chirping really loud at somebody's head. <laughs> I tell you what, dude, for like a few weeks, right? We had this Cardinal come up to my old job. And this thing was friendly to humans, but it like came up and just would scream like, <laughs> Just chirp its little heart away. Like, get right on the table in your face and just do it. It was like my fat cat coming right on the bed into my face, going, Meow! It, it, it's like, it's like intense, trying to get your intention to listen to it sing. It was adorable, but it was like, oh my goodness. What is your problem, little bird? Let's see. But you got something you want to say, especially over here, right? Because there might have been a missed opportunity that you, well, that you missed, you know? And that, it, oh, it might actually be with this water sign right here. Uh, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, Spellbind, Charisma, they are not. That might not be working too much anymore in their favor. Hmm. This Nine of Swords reverse, right? Let's see. What's up with this chick? 
Oh, there's just all sorts of fuckery going on here. Turmoil, disorder with the Five of Wands. A lot of conflict mentally about how they need to change and grow. What? How someone needs to evolve and stop wasting time. Just... Hmm. Like, someone wants to stand in their power, but they don't want to do the work to get there, I'd say. Like, whoever this is, Libra, like, they're mauling over how they should have just, like, done something different. But down here, they're more tortured about the fact that, like, they weren't able to obtain the power without ha getting the chance to waste some time. It's like, you know, this person wanted to look like a martyr and stand like they did something powerful that helped them in some way but they're tortured because it brought nothing but turmoil and distress right hmm. let's see eight of cups what's up with it that's what I'm going to do with the lovers right here. Possibly Gemini. Some more air in this. Well, there was an air. Well, there was the air sign. Knight of Swords anyway. But it's like someone wanted to chirp their intention in all this. Someone wanted to bring some, like, disappointments up. But I think they're afraid of how they're going to come off when it comes to this love situation, right? Like, you're afraid that you're going to cut your charm and your spellbinding capabilities aren't going to work and then you're just going to come unraveled? Is that it? Like, is someone like that kind of, like, narc? Because, <laughs> like, you know, it's easier just to do it than to sit there and think about how you're going to do it, you know? Let's see. This person down here, like... Hmm... Libra, this person's vibration is just really awkward. And I don't know if this is you or someone you're dealing with, but it's like... I don't know. Look at that! They're like, and they're still wasting time. They're still trying to look like a martyr. Like, the, like hangman's here twice. Twice is not always as nice, you know? I mean, you can only waste time for so long, but now they just keep doing it. <laughs> That's terrible. Aww. Let's see. Thoughts and feelings with this King of Pentacles reverse, right? Either someone feels like they're owed something, or they're a mooch. And then they just put on the show like they owe something, right? Let's see. Knowledge and insight. This could be somebody who is expecting to be given some sort of information. High Priestess from someone, Necromancer Seer. Well, that's down here. So is, is somebody expecting someone to be resurrected from the dead or some shit? Or knowledge and seeking how to do that or become the high races or I'm not sure. In order to reach heaven. So this King of Pentacles might be getting knowledge in order to become a high priestess in order to get to heaven. That's the thoughts and feelings, either that or like you feel like this dude is supposed to be, like, given or he owes some information to somebody. Possibly needs to use their intuition about it in order to actually be able to communicate. Reach that uh, level of heaven, if you will. But down here is the root of the situation with death. Uh, this all just fell out. Um... There was a lot of distress and confusion, but that's over now. But that might have left you, Libra, a little bit insane. 
little bit spiteful, a little bit like, you know, you can cut a motherfucker. Because you found out that there was no love, and you still didn't know about the options that surrounded you. Like, no more information was given completely. Um, probably left you feeling a little bit, like in the, a little bit insecure with your monies, to the point where you watch that stuff like a hawk, better yet, a falcon, a peregrine falcon. Very sharp, if you will. Trying to dominate and master what you needed. You still might need a break of some sort, and it, but you're still kind of like on the down low looking at little things or, um, what, kids? Possibly kids following you around or something? Like, maybe you just need to be sharp around them. Keep them in line and stuff, right? Let's see. Death card reverse. This is the roots and the thoughts and the feelings. Um, everything's dying because it didn't work, and no one could think of a better way of making things work, right? Um, but then they got the three ones. They're just like, wait, I'm gonna be cunning and genius somehow. I just need to wait a little bit. So something didn't work out because someone didn't want to think of ways to work out. So now they're just waiting. And seeing what happens and how they can use their ingenuity and savvy. Because they're a spiteful bitch. Libra. <laughs> like, is someone waiting for you to calm down when it comes to their crazy antics? Okay, the vibration with this Empress Reverse. Hierophant, the Sage, the Mentor. Taurus's card. Might be a teacher of some sort. She also has the two of cups right here. Huh. An ace of pentacles reverse? Okay, I don't know. Maybe I just need to, like, hmm. Libra, I don't think this is much about you. It's like something that went on around you or if this is something to do with you it's something that's been on your brain for a while but it's like this empress reverse she is like a little bitter but it's like she's almost a teacher of it's better to have love than money which is kind of crazy if you ask me like, most people don't really have that idea in mind when they think that shit, but I think she's one of those that really means it. But she's also, like, kind of bitter, I think, because she has no one to share that with, either. Like, the Hierophant and her are both alone. There are two cups, but there's only one coin. You know what I'm saying? Like... Alright, this King of Pentacles up here. It's all reverse. What's up with him? He's reversed because he's still mulling over some shit I think he invested in and lost out on. And now he's got to take some those two cups once again and have to get over that shit. So this could be the same person. Death, death right here. I almost said it was reversed and it's actually not. Queen of Wands. Sagittarius Leo Aries. Very young, very naive, but she's working it quite well. Maybe a Leo. She's got a little kitty cat right there, too. Also could be definitely Sagittarius. Okay. So this page of cups. Trying to open up after, like, hurt feelings and all that stuff. Let's see. Um, feeling like you're trapped and confined in misery and torment. That's uh, not nice. And wanting to start something new, starting from the very beginning. Like, you feel like you're in the action of being tormented. Misery. But now you want the action of success. Of rule. Or maybe that's how you got stuck there in the first place. No, you're trying to get out of it. You're trying to get out of all of the distress and confusion. Ace of Cups. A new heartfelt beginning, right? That was in the past with gifts and bounties. Um, 
Someone might not have changed and shift shaped or shape shift ship shaped. Jesus. Uh Booty Man did not go running, I will say. Give them in that fire sign once again. No, 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 this person didn't go running. They stayed anchored with the Knight of Coin right here. I'm not sure what to make of your reading, Libra. The Hermit or the Alien reversed right here, right? Trying to come out of that isolation. What are you going to do with that? You got the Lovers, Twin Souls, Reverence. So it's like you're going to try to pair up with your person. Try to come out of this shy and timid energy. Because there's a little bit of injustice with it. Okay, I got you. Alright, so this page of cups up here. Yeah, you're trying to take a leap of faith. Good deal. And then with this ace of cups, what you're trying to do... Uh, what is this? Alright, what is this? <laughs> Alright, Libra, what is this for reals? Because this is like... This is like Lynn Close just boiled your child's rabbit to send the message that she loves you. Like, this is like, kind of like a little bit obsessive. Mmm. It's like you're holding a grudge. Well, like, I don't know if it is you or the other person, because I'm not sure who this is entirely in this reading, but it's like, you know... Like, like, why is the Ace of Cups, like, leading to the Queen of Cups being all angry? Is this because someone didn't move and stayed anchored where they were? Yeah. Someone's coming out of a nasty, nasty connection or obsession with somebody. But the Devil Reverse, possibly Capricorn... After they leave this tunnel with the alien reversed right here, it's like, okay, I'm going to come out of this cave, and I'm going to do what I need to do, and would have cut this connection once and for all. I don't know, Labor, it's almost like you're holding a grudge because someone didn't love you the way you want them to. Oh, I forgot about this one over here with this vibration. Or something, you know, I'm, I like... Or someone feels that way about you. Like, you didn't love them the way they wanted you to. Like, this person's taking a leap of faith away from this water sign where it, it takes them out of this whole, um, nasty environment with this person. It's like... The nasty person's, like, pissed because you didn't love them the way they wanted you to. This vibration, I almost forgot about it. Yeah, I think, Libra, you're all mad and you're not the one taking the leave of faith. You're staying where you are. Like, whoever it is you're dealing with, I think that they want to work things out with you. And they're upset that you don't. But it, at the same time, you can only tell somebody I'm done so many ways before you just finally have to be like, I'll just... I, like, you know what? I, I'm just gonna change my number and, like, leave. I'm never, you're never gonna see me again. I'm done. I'm done. You get on my nerves. You're kind of stupid. You know, like, and, like you, listen, you start making a list of cons more than you make pros. Once a person hits that kind of level, you know, and I think that person hit this level with you. It's like... They, they, they've been wasting time thinking that they didn't have to put any of the work in just hanging out around thinking that they're going to stand in their power and they're still wasting their time doing that Libra you know. and you lost your shit about it with the Queen of Swords reverse so it's like it's weird that they want to hold a grudge because you don't want to be in a shitty relationship anymore it makes no sense but people are people you know anyway Libras and cross watchers that's the end of the reading hooray so if you like this and you want to like share or subscribe the reads just go right ahead
It's all up to you, really, but I would greatly appreciate it. But I will see you guys later. Bye-bye.